Hi there, happy Wednesday evening in tonight's fun game of where can we find more than one baby micro bar of cell service. I am sitting on the floor in front of my front door. So this was the winner. For a while there, it looked like I was going to be coming to you from my bathroom, but then that bar went away. So how is everyone doing on our second day of e-fuel in our fuel cycle? Tomorrow we go into FP. How you feeling about that? That can be tougher, um, but if we think ahead and think of all the fantastic options that we have, it's really not that bad. Okay, because there's a lot of good stuff we can eat. And... Um, Try not to focus on what we can't have, okay? So, but let's talk about today first. So, early this morning, I made the new PPP oatmeal. Have you guys tried that? I put a link to it last week. Um, if you can't find it here in this group, you can search it on YouTube. Um, it's on the, I think it's on the Trim Healthy Mama channel. Or maybe go to their, um, their main Facebook group or the... Yeah, either the Facebook group or their author page. And you can find it there. So I love that. It's super filling. It's a nice change from just regular oatmeal. The key is, though, to stir the stuffings out of it. I think it says like 30 seconds to a minute. I do a full minute and then some. Okay, otherwise it's not the world's greatest texture. Not what you want to have in the morning. So I had that and a light coffee. Um, I forgot to have a snack in the middle of the morning. Um, so I just um, had a few of those banana muffins I made yesterday for lunch. What did we have? Oh, super good. Sweetie on steroids. That's in the Trim Healthy Cookbook. Super yummy. Um, very filling. I love it. I gotta confess, I didn't have much greens today. Um, so I'm gonna go make an okra shake as soon as we're done here. I promise, promise. Okay, okay, I think I'm back, woo! Okay, I went to our Wi-Fi, which is every bit as dicey, but maybe it's better. All right, thanks for hanging with me. Okay, so Sweetie on Steroids, Trim Healthy Cookbook, super love it, um, really good. It just doesn't, it just, seems very filling. So I did that. And then for a snack, creature habit, my iced coffee every day. And then a couple more of those banana muffins before I ran out of the house to take the kids to dance. Now, normally when my kids are at dance, if I'm feeling a little hungry or something, I'll go to Jimmy John's and get an unwitch. But because of what I'm doing here, because I'm focusing on quality carbs and no fat or very little fat, that wasn't an option. So I just waited till I got home and I made the a quick version of the mango, black bean mango chicken, blackened chicken with mangoes and black beans or something like that. So good, it is so, so good. If you haven't tried that one, I believe that's in Trim Healthy Cookbook. Also, if you don't have that book, you need that book because, yep, almost every day, cook out of that one. Um, so I already had cooked chicken because I knew I would be doing this. So just cooking up a bunch of chicken breasts just makes it easy to throw something together. So I didn't actually blacken the chicken. I just um, threw in some like pepper and onion frozen blend, can of black beans, the seasonings, lime juice, a little bit of sweetener, and then some diced up frozen mango chunks and some chicken. Stirred it up. It's delicious super good and I had popcorn popcorn's my kryptonite if there's popcorn around I cannot stay out of it I gotta admit it's really bad um, but popcorn is okay when you're just eating the carbs you're supposed to keep it in moderation and that's where I struggle so sometimes I just don't even allow myself one piece but tonight I had a couple handfuls and now I'm going to go have a shake with okra because I'm trying to do okra at least in some fashion every single day for the next two weeks. And that's it. So tomorrow we go into FP land. I'll probably have an egg white stir fry for uh, breakfast 
and a pad thai with lots of cabbage and kohlrabi and maybe some broccoli slaw. I'll probably do the broccoli slaw for breakfast and the cabbage and kohlrabi for lunch um, with just egg white. And I don't know what I'm going to do for dinner. I'm going to have to get creative tomorrow. But I'll tell you about that tomorrow. So have a fantastic evening. Take care, y'all. Bye.